What's up, guys? I'm Thick Teddy, and this is another episode of Technicals with Teddy. Thank you guys for tuning in. Drop a like on the video, subscribe to the channel, comment what you want to see me make a video about, and I'll work on making those in the future. But most of all, just thank you guys for watching these videos. This is going to be a short three minute video about reversals. Reversals are one of probably, eh, I don't want to say the easiest but best ways to make a lot of money on, on plays. Um, if you can time a reversal correctly, that might be the best possible way for you to maximize the amount of money that you're going to make on that play uh, and on that day and maybe that week, maybe that month. If you get really good at reversals, that can be something that can carry you long term if that's one of the pillars of your strategy because reversals oftentimes um, create bigger moves than continuation patterns. So I'm going to talk to you guys today. I have a few examples of reversals and I have a few ways that we can we can just kind of give you guys a starter for setups for reversals. So I have two examples here. Uh, both of them are from this week and this is the spy chart. But the first one you guys can see here is this reversal that happened right in this area. Let me draw a circle right around that area so we can just highlight it. So in this area, you guys can see we have a nice green candle that uh, moves into the reversal zone. And then there is a rejection candle with a long upper wick there. And then there's the red candle that begins the rejection uh, and or reversal. So what i want you guys to notice here is that long upper wick you can see that long upper wick paired with the the pretty good volume here what does that show us that shows us that the bears were able to push down the bulls at the end of that candle and basically um, negate any of the movement that the bulls had during that entire candle and that's the indicator of reversal and then you guys can see the the large move that we saw afterwards if you were on options this would have paid hundreds of percent so if you can time these reversals um, using wicks possibly then you're going to make a lot of money so that's the first example and then the second example is going to be this bottom one here and i want to show you guys basically um, there's two bottoms here the second one being a higher low and that's your indicator here of, of reversal so you guys can see there's this first low here uh, I pointed at it with that first arrow. And then there's the second low here, and it's higher than the first low. The first low happened at about 407.60. The second low happened at about 407.75. Once that second low is put in with this green candle here, you can feel free to buy that and ride that on reversal. So biggest things here for this video, guys, are watch for the wicks. If they have high volume, the wicks can be a great indicator of reversal. And then also higher lows. Um, and you can use that vice versa, so lower highs would work for a reversal to the downside. Like I said, reversals are extremely lucrative. You guys can make a lot of money if you can time reversals right. They're a bit more risky based on the fact that continuation happens and it's a little bit fighting the trend. But if you can find these right setups, then you guys can can make out like bandits and uh, yeah, grow your account using this. So thank you guys again for tuning in. I hope this helps. I hope this gives you guys kind of a, a, a layout to, to look for for reversals. And we'll be back again next week. Thank you.